Today is the Monday before the crucifixion. It's the day after Jesus' triumphal entry into the city of Jerusalem where he came riding in on a donkey and people from all different directions waving palm branches. See, that night he stayed in the city of Bethany, but today, on Monday, he returns to the city of Jerusalem and he goes straight to the temple. When he gets to the temple, he stops in the courtyard and all he sees is people selling, trading, buying goods. Just imagine out here filled with cows and ox and sheep and people buying those and trading those and then you see the money exchangers changing money and just all kinds of people doing business deals and Jesus he looks around and he's just furious at this at what they turned his father's house into and so what happens next we read in Matthew 21 12 he says Jesus entered the temple and he drove out all who sold and bought in the temple and he overturned the tables of the money changers and the seats of those who sold pigeons what a sight that must have been just to see jesus walking in and driving these people out flipping over their tables the anger that he had just because of how they turned his father's house into this marketplace and so jesus being who he was he decided to use this as a teaching moment. And so in the next verse, we see in verse 13, it says, He said to them, It's written, My house shall be called a house of prayer, but you make it a den of robbers. See, Jesus, his, his zeal for his father's house was so infectious that the people all around were drawn in to listen to what he had to say. You know, obviously he, he created this big scene, um, but people were they, intrigued. They wanted to know what he had to say. And so he teaches them about God's house and how it should, should be a house of prayer. And it should be something that's held up in high regard. And, and everyone came, even the chief priests and the scribes, they came too because they were terrified because the people were listening. And they were also terrified just because they were calling him Hosanna, son of David. And so they began to challenge him as well. But Jesus didn't back down from them either. And so after this event, after this um, altercation, he then returns to the city of Bethany. For the next verse in 21:17, it says, And leaving them, he went out of the city to Bethany, and he lodged there. God, we thank you so much for today we thank you for this holy monday we thank you lord that your your son had so much passion for your house for your temple god and we pray that you would give us that um, same passion lord god we pray just for just for the same zeal that our lord jesus had for um for your house to make it a house of prayer and so we we ask for that today we ask for that same passion god and we just ask that we can be drawn closer to you and nearer to you as we think about the life of jesus it's in his son's name we pray amen today is monday but sunday's coming